Um, alright. Uh, what's down here? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, place the torch first. Just make sure that everything is safe and secure. We don't fall down to our deaths where we can't come back. Okay. Alright, we're going in. Hey guys, this is Hiron Wolf, and welcome to Hiron's gameplay of Starbound, a sci-fi sandbox adventure game, I don't know what to call it, that I have loved since I first played it. Um, just an announcement before we start, um, it has gone through a major update since I last played. I mean, I played a little bit of this new update, but it is huge. Either that or I missed multiple updates. Anyway, there's a lot more. There's an actual kind of intro quest thing. There's multiple quests. There's lots more items. There's lots more cool stuff. And a new race was added. The Nova Kid. So, um, you guys, if you've never played Starbound, have probably no idea what I'm talking about. But anyway, I need to get into the game. Um, I'm going to make a new character. I have an older character. I had other characters before, but they got deleted since the new update began. So I just decided to try to know. But I went through the mods and found a Sergal species. If you don't know what a Sergal is, um, I will be linking the wiki page of, about Sergals because there's a lot or a good amount about them and they're pretty cool I mean I myself I'm I'm wolf and I've loved wolves forever I will probably always be a wolf but circles are pretty cool too they're their own species they're not like I think people have been confused that they're some sort of hybrid thing I mean, Yeah, I think there's a book about them, a book like story type novel about them, which is awesome. And um, I can't remember what the creator's name of the species is, but it should say on the wiki, and I will probably link, put that in the description too. Because as I said, I like circles. I think they're cool. And I'm gonna play as one in Starbound, so yeah! And I've been talking for like two minutes, so um, I customized my character. There's some selections in here that don't seem to do anything. I don't know if that's just me, or if that's, or if it's just because nothing's been edited at that point. Um, if there are more versions, I will probably be showing those off because I think this. As I said, just like four times already. Anyway, I need to stop talking and um, let's get in, shall we? I'm excited. There's supposed to be a custom ship and everything for the for this species and some and items and everything. Oh, cool! Oh, wow! What is what? It's all quiet now. I am unsure of how long I was asleep for. But it seems the ship has stopped functioning in orbit of, of an unknown planet before setting out in a search of fuel. I should reactivate the ship's comm systems. Press E to interact with objects. Alright, so we have our first quest. Ooh. And our ship is not looking good. Something happened here. It is not good. Oh, I have a tail. Oh, that is awesome. My guy looks so cool. There's custom animations. And, okay, how do I jump again? Oh, yeah. There's custom animations and everything it is coolness. I forget how to play. Um, all right, that looks awesome. That is super awesome. My guy's character panel blinks. Um, but we gotta reactivate. I gotta, I gotta con calm down, Iron. Mm. Okay. Whoa. Oh. Um, something's happening. So the comms are not working. 
Yes, I get it. I know, I know. I'm reactivating them. All right. Greetings, soldier. I am advi advisorial program version 3.1. As I cannot detect superior officers, nor am I currently able to contact Shigu Command, you will be following my inbuilt orders until otherwise said. That's kind of cool. I haven't read any of the books. I probably will, but if this is referencing stuff from them, I think a lot of Circle fans will be going crazy about now. Anyway, I have refabricated some of the engine to sh allow the ship's backup power online. Everything else will have to wait until you can provide some resources. All right, adversarial program. I've got a, I've got fabricate. Apex, before they went hostile, provided us with the plans of a device called the matter manipulator, capable of altering almost any material's mass. You can use it. Okay, I'm not going to read all this because that'll take too long. You can pause and read it if you want. Enabled. The, ma the, the, the matter manipulator is important, by the way my previous experiences. I have sent it. Get to work! Alright! Um, you can't see it, but the, um, salute for circles is covering the left eye, I think. Right? I know it's a salute for a certain circle commander, or general, general reign, but if I'm getting anything wrong, any of you circle experts can tell me in the comments below. Anyway, I probably should enable the warp field. I can transmit the privileges for our ship to ground warp field. Yes, that would be great. Tutorial 1, a flash of light. First thing I should do is check the ship's locker. At the very least, I need a flashlight, but there should be some other supplies in there too. Alright, it is done. Great. Wait, 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 wait. Um, can I reach, fabricate the... But I'll need 20... Okay, I don't think I have core fragments. And here's the manipulator. The mid -a -mid -a -mid matter manipulator. Nope, my door won't work, so I can't get to my cockpit. So, what's in my storage? Ooh, I have a flashlight. That's important. Whoa, what did it do? Okay, the control button is weird. That's weird. What the heck? Okay, I guess it's some sort of view thing. That was a little strange. I just was trying to okay okay that was obviously some sort of like spectating different view thing so I'm just gonna click this time yeah the best quest completed anyway a uh, flash a flashlight a weapon and a few torches for good measure time to head down to the planet yes it's time to make a crafting table I should beam down to the planet use my matter material fell trees for void the crafting menu blah 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 all right okay I think it's shift actually that okay yeah buh, buh, buh. So, I have a circle heirloom. Looks like a spear that should help when I'm battling bad guys. Oh, I have my own little sound. Ha! Ha! Yeah! Ha! I'll spear you! Yeah! Alright, I'm gonna arrange these here. I'm gonna put this in here so then I'll always be holding it. So if I want to hold my spear, then I'll be able to spear while using a flashlight. Alright. I'm also gonna, um, move these over here, because that's my usual orientation. That's what I have. It usually, I usually have that there. But anyway, we're gonna beam down to the planet and start our circle adventures. Alright. Gotta load. A lot of stuff. Ooh. Nice looking planet we have here. Don't think I need my flashlight, but okay. Um, all right. Yep. Yes. All right. So we started entering. We need to get a crafting table. I am expecting that I'm gonna. Ow. Okay. I'm. I'm fine. That oh, didn't do anything. Okay. Um. Right. We gotta fell some trees. Yes. Amazing what technology can do, huh? Timber! Yes! Alright. We got some unrefined wood and some saplings. Alright, um... Wood. We need 35 wood planks. How many can I make right now? Nine! Oh, I 
think I see alien woodworm. I guess. Uh, anyway, so we're obviously gonna need a lot more wood from these trees. Oh yeah, we got a lot more wood that time. At 15. Unrefined logs of wood. In timber. Every time I make one of these, it's three wood planks. Okay, that's not so bad. Um, I'm gonna do. Aha! Here we go. Now I can make a crafting table. Do do do! It's such a nice sound when you make when you complete a quest. It's just this nice little piano. And great! I can use this crafting table to create lots of items that I can make with that I can't make with my bare hands. Because even though my power is awesome. There are things I just can't do without help. That's a lesson for all of you. No matter how good you think you are at something, there will be things you will need help with. Anyway, enough with the moral lessons. Plant fibers can be used to fashion bandages in case I get hurt. I should chop down some vines to obtain plant fibers and turn them into bandage by hand. Better safe than sorry. Exactly. That is a good idea. I should probably make a campfire. Embers dance with. Use the heat cooking. That is a good idea. We should make that. Alright. So I got a campfire. And I got a crafting table. Gotta go find some vines. So I can cut down. Ooh. You look like an uh, unknown alien. Ah. Hey! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, he hurts. He hurts very much. Yikes. Jeez, I'm glad I, I at least killed him fast enough. Got some raw steak. Raw slab of weird string I didn't reach. It's steak. What are you talking about? Um, but ow! That hurt. Yeah, I definitely need some bandages now. Um, so where would I find vines? Probably in a jungle. I wonder what other kind of weapons I get. I mean, I like this sphere. It's a nice... It's obviously a circle heirloom, which heirlooms are nice, but I would probably prefer something that, well, I'd probably need something a little, it actually does pretty good damage, but, um, I'm not used to using spears, so maybe a sword or a gun will probably help better. Anyway, uh, hi, no, 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 you will not, no, don't you dare, don't you dare kill me, no, stay back, you beast. I am trained in the martial arts of Circle Fu. Ah! No! Okay, we're just gonna run. He moved past us. We're just gonna run for it. Um. Okay, we'll find him later. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Those are vines down there in the water. And it gets all quiet as we go underwater. Uh, matter meant to be later. Quickly, I don't want to drown. All right, got some plant fibers, yay. Um, you, you stay over there. Oh, I'm dripping wet. <laughs> Just shake it off. All right, uh, bandages, yes. How many bandages? Is Two. What? How many? Oh, I need four. Okay. That wasn't too bad. Uh, it was kind of bad. I can make all sorts of things from plant fibers, from rope to cloth. To stay healthy and add to my cognate. What the heck? Just this pop-up thing came up. I don't know if you guys saw it or not. Dang, pop-up. Notification things. Anyway, to stay healthy and add to my combat. Combat. Combat effectiveness. I'll need to cook some food. I should attain some raw steak by killing a monster with a hunting bow or hunting spear. Cook it on a campfire to produce cooked steak. Uh, I already got some steak, so I guess I should use the campfire. And it is raining. Is that good? 
um, just in case I'm gonna probably try and find some shelter. I'm also gonna use this bandage because I am hurting. All right, that did a good amount of health. Um, eh, eh, yeah, there we go. Ooh, what is this? Corn. Ooh, I get. I learned how to craft a corn cob. My awesome crafting skills are kicking in. Anyway, got some more corn here. Ooh, the plant fiber. That's good. Um, I think this is cold down here. There's a there's a scary monster over there. Not really, but we're gonna. Yes, Hada! Yeah, we got some pixels. Which is the money system in this game. And it's getting dark fast. I'm glad I got this flashlight. I should I will leave that for right now. I'm gonna find oh I hi. These guys are aggressive, so I gotta be careful. Man, I wish I had some Okay, um forget any forget trying to find shelter. Let's build one. Um all right, wait. Uh, um, wait. Crafting. All right. Uh, right here. Okay. We're gonna make a shelter. I'm gonna pick this up and knock this down. We're gonna build ourselves a house. Release a nice little shelter place. You know, so we don't. Starve and freeze from the cold rain. Anyway, alright. Wait, what what do you mean I can't build it? Oh, there we go. There. I am the building master. Alright. That should be good. Mm, good. Alright. I think to make a wall you just do this. A little bit of this. A little bit of more of this. And here. 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 Here, put some right there, and there, and there, and there, and I'm running out of wood blocks. Okay, time to cut down another tree. You'll be able to tell where I am because there'll be gaps of tr just gaps where trees aren't. All right, get some more. Wood. Okay. In it. And. Uh huh. Alright. That's good. And. We're gonna make just a little bit more of the wall. Okay. I guess we'll be making more wall. That's always good. And. Put some. There we go. That's good. There we go. I'm gonna put some torches. We need light, and we're gonna put campfire there. Keep warm. We put a crafting table. There we go. Now, time to cook some steak. We will be eating royally tonight. Delicious! I'm sure I can cook some even tastier dishes once I find better ingredients. Maybe I should craft a hoe and find some seeds if I can plant. Wink, wink. Hint, hint. Craft a hoe and garden. Okay, tutorial five, out of the frying pan. To make more advanced items, I need to craft a stone furnace using the crafting table. And a stone furnace, blah, blah, blah. Metal bars. Okay, that's good. It's basically the tutorial right now. Um, I'm gonna... Do I need to eat? Are you hostile? You better not be hostile. <laughs> you stay away from me. All right, got my very large steak here. Jeez, that's big. Okay. Um, I'm expecting that I can make a lot more. Ooh! Uh, doors would probably be very good in this kind of situation. Alright. Got me some doors. Ah! And... I apparently made the house big enough that I can put doors in. That's good. That is a good thing. Um, now I have my own little shelter! My own little circle house. Okay. Alright, um, what was it? What was the quest? Oh, yeah, stone furnace. Okay. So I would need stone. 
But I'm gonna eat some steak. What is is it? Ooh, that heals me. That is good. That is great. Thank you, steak. And I'm guessing this uh, little symbol here means um, I won't be hungry. Something like that. Okay. Um. So. Ooh, stop raining. That's good. All right. Ooh. Yes. Let's put a little light here. Just to brighten up the night. Okay. So, seeing as we need some stone, we'll just mine some here. I'm pretty sure the stone won't mind when I mine it. This is reference to a Tavuska song. Everybody. Okay. I don't know exactly how much you need for the stone furnace, but we're gonna take at least 30 would probably be good. But I don't want to take too much that I can't jump. Oh, I have massively awesome jumping skills. Massively awesome. Which is that? Oh, oh, I'm. Uh, don't want to drown. Yeah. Just shake off. I'm dry now. And somehow the torch was in front of the door when I opened it. Um. Anyway, we're not gonna, we're not gonna focus on that. That's that's not important. Okay. What is? Ooh, we need a campfire. Okay. Uh, crap. I need, I need unrefined wood. So I need to cut down another tree. All right. I don't think you can, but it'd, it'd be kind of funny if I like, if I cut down one of these trees and it just fell on the enemy. Hey, come here. Get a little closer. I want to test. No, don't go. Don't go away. Ah, didn't do anything. Don't do no. <laughs> Ow! Dang, he hurts. He hurts about as he does about as much damage as I do. Ah, but he can't take it as much as I can. Cause I'm tough. Oh, oops. Oh, okay. That. Apparently, I can just <laughs> just <laughs> blow out the torches. Cause it's daytime. Why do we need torches? Um, that is a very nice sunrise. Effect, actually. Let's just let's let's sit here for a little while and admire how awesome that sunrise is. That is a very nice sunrise. Okay, enough admiring. Um. Anyway, what we're doing? We were trying to make a campfire. Campfire crafted, and now we make us. Stone furnace. Yes! Awesome! Try to time to play with fire. Iron Wolf does not condone playing around with fire. Fire is dangerous. Or can be, if used improperly. So be safe with fire. This should work for most basic metals like copper and iron, and you can use build a more advanced furnace later on. Okay. I'm going to need better tools if I'm going to survive down here. Yes, exactly. I should start by making use of a furnace and smelting on some copper ore to obtain a copper bar. The deeper underground I go, the more likely I am to find ore. Alright, we've got a smart guy. We're playing a smart guy here. Oh my god, was well, it's... I, I'm smart. I don't know. You guys think I'm smart? <laughs> anyway, um, okay, wait. Alright, we gotta place this furnace, but I don't know if we have enough room. Okay, we'll just place it on top of the crafting table. Because that's normal. Um, what do we do? Okay. So, obviously, we're gonna need to go mining and craft some... Or, get some copper ore to craft some copper bars so we can get some armor for our awesome circle dude. Ooh, wait, 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 wait a second. Is this always here? I think it was. But I didn't see it. Yeah, I got some pixels. I am rich. I have 102. <laughs> That's probably not rich. Um, but there's this. Uh, there's some coal here. Apparently, and I'm gonna get it. Ooh, learn to craft gunpowder. That'll probably be important later on. There's some more birds. 
So far they don't seem to have attacked me, so I'm okay with them just flying around. That's a rule in general. If you don't attack me, depending on other factors, then I'm okay with you being around. You know, if like if you're playing a game like this, I mean depending on what your standards are and stuff. But if you don't attack me, I won't attack you. Unless you give me reason to. And we should all be good. Anyway. Um, we have a codex here. Should I or shouldn't I? That is the question. But what does that mean exactly? I'm gonna get away from that bird because I still don't... Are you hostile? Huh? No. I jumped like two feet. Oh, like two feet. Or a foot from it. So what is this? Read selected. What is this? As accordance with protocol, before the event of immediate nuclear strike, I was thrown aboard on board by my superior officer. Before I had the chance to wait for their return, the nuclear strike siren went off. The enemy had dropped a bomb on us. Oh, this doesn't sound good. I had to hightail it out of there. Out and leave everyone else at the port. Much to my shame, but the mission must go on. Oh, that's sad. Everyone else... Did they all die? Blast of early damage to the ship threw me about... And not being unconscious with the ship hurling out into space. Oh, so that's why my ship was all beat up. I appear to have woken in orbit of some unknown planet. Could this be the world we were searching for? What world? Ooh, we have some story now. I'm liking this. Starbound survival guide. Holy crap, we have a lot of pages. Well, I'm not gonna read that right now. Circle's journey begins. Let's read what is this? Venus is under constant warfare. That's our planet, I believe. Alien invaders introduced the nuclear fission. With that comes every Circle Clan vying for ownership of the Nevrians, the only creatures on Phyllis currently capable of producing more. So it's like a struggle for a certain type of item. <sighs> Can't you guys all just get along, share? No, I guess not. But you wouldn't have so many problems if you did. Um, mission. Your mission was not to defend your clan. Your mission was to scout the galaxy to find suitable plans for co colonization for when Villas is eventually shrouded in permanent nuclear winter. Oh, wow. That's actually a very important mission, if you think about it. My planet's going to die. Finding another suitable planet is a very important mission. I just noticed these trees sway as the wind and rain and everything. That's cool, too. Anyway, continuing on with the story. You can skip through this if this is boring. Anyway, you were the only sur surviving... Um, hey, by the way, as a, just not to be really annoying, but you're missing a... That bird went way too close to me. Anyway, you're s missing an eye here. Anyway, continue on like nothing happened. Remember, this, you were the only surviving member of your team that made it to the ship escaping from a particularly violent air raid. After it entered... In indeterminate. Oh, sorry. I couldn't tell what that word was. I'm pretty sure that's an actual word, though. No. Anyway, indeterminate. Yeah, that's a word. Amount of travel. That means I didn't know how much travel I did. Anyway, your ship has finally run out of fuel in orbit on an unknown planet, and alone, with n and with no one, including your captain. To provide orders, you now have choices. Do you continue your mission looking for viable planets? Or do you move on to some doing something different? Abandon your clan. The choice is yours. Mm. I'm not sure if I'm okay with that choice. Okay. That's normal stuff that I can read later. Alright, so we're gonna we gotta go mining. Um Do I get a pickaxe eventually? Whoa, hey, 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 hey. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No need to get angry. I'm just gonna pass by here. What are these things? They're just angry all the time. And is he still coming after me? Nope. Alright. I gotta remember where my shelter will be. So, you know, I don't lose track of it. This looks like a good kind of... Ooh! Forget the cave! There is a chest here! What? Nothing? 
<laughs> Why did you give me a chest? Okay, it's randomly generated. I shouldn't complain. Probably someone else took something from it, but I'm gonna take it. I'll come in handy later. But what else? It's getting dark again. Dang, this these these hours pass by so quickly. Um, all right. Uh, what's down here? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, place the torch first. Just make sure that everything is safe and secure. We don't fall down to our deaths where we can't come back. Okay. Alright. We're going in. There's some water there. Some vines. I should probably take those. Right then. We got some. Yes. Ooh, more vines. Right. Good. Hmm. Doesn't look like this really leads anywhere. Uh, ooh, wait, 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 what is that? Okay, that's just coal. <sighs> Dang, coal, why couldn't it be copper? Uh, I guess I'll take it anyway. I'll need these to... Need these. Need this to... Uh, craft torches, I think? I don't know. Yes, I think it is. Because that's what it usually is. Stuff like Minecraft and such. But I'm not gonna compare this to Minecraft because this is a lot different. I mean, in the sense, gameplay, yes, it is the same as Minecraft because you're crafting stuff to survive. But there's a lot of games like that, and I don't think there are many that take it at this type of angle. Maybe, I don't know. I haven't played many. But, um,. I need to get out of this hole because it's getting this video is running long and uh, this will be the end of the dang it this will be the, <sighs> this will be the end of the video um well not this I, I need to get back to my shelter but um I think that will be all for today Oh, he's hostile, too. Back off. What was that he tried to shoot at me? Oh, it's getting really raining now. Yes, I should probably get back to my shelter. Ha! Punk. Can't handle the circle awesomeness. Anyway. I'm gonna get inside, because it's raining really hard. I need to get some shelter. Um, I think that I can craft a bed. I don't, what do I need to craft a bed? Oh, that's cool. Circle flags. Clan Shiwu's flag. Glorious villas. Villas colors. Alright. Um. Bed, 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 bed. Wood bed. Wooden bed. Oh, I need more planks. Uh, can I craft more planks? Yes, I can. Alright. I'm just gonna craft a few more. There we go. I have a bed now. Um. Right. Uh, I'm gonna end that here. I mean, I can't put. I was gonna place the bed bed and sleep, but uh, I think I'll end this here. It's been a good while. I have my shelter. I have a objective for next time. Um, if you guys enjoyed this, uh, like, leave a comment, or even subscribe, cause this is appreciated. And thanks for watching. Um, this is really cool uh, I've been away from Starbound for entirely too long apparently and um, I'm gonna get back into it I'm gonna play more of this most likely um, especially if you guys like it especially if you guys think this is awesome and um, I hope you enjoyed that I was playing a circle for any of you circle fans and uh, this is fun this is really cool all the story, even though I don't understand all of it. Because I'm not a circle expert. I'm really new to it, the whole thing. But, I think it's pretty awesome. Anyway. Uh, that'll be all for today. And, I'll see you all in the next video. This is Iron Wolf, signing off. Doing the circle salute. Goodbye!